lone wanderer in the fallout of what used to be his home. Jump! No, no, let's not jump over. <laughs> okay. Hello players, and welcome back to TVB Plays Fallout 4. So what happened last episode, we got invited into this vault, it, there was an explosion. They my wife got killed, and my baby Sean nicked. So, let's see what happens now. It's been a critical failure after we were put to sleep again, so let's go see the wife. Hello. Come on! There has to be a release! Oh, yeah. Control panel. Come on, come on, come on! Faster, oh, faster. I will punch this shit open. Don't hit the wife, though. That would be weird. Nora? You can... How have you completely frozen? Yeah, I was fine. I'll find who did this. Then I'll get Sean back. I promise. My, like, what a heartbreaking in intro. That's devastating. Oh, God. Is everyone else dead? Why would Vault do this? Wait, is that Mrs. Whitfield? No. Oh. So everybody dead. Everybody dead. Wait, the... Oh, somebody turned off the life support. Was it those guys? Why would... Why wasn't I dead? And yet everyone else is. This is concerning to me. Right, well, let's get going, shall we? So again, I have played through this bit, but as soon as we... But pretty much as soon as we get out the vault, I don't know what I'm doing, so... Let's just have a look around. My god, how many people were in these? How many people died unnecessarily? Sorry, how many people were murdered, I meant to say? Oh, another suit. And some clipboards. Not really the most useful of stuff. Oh, oh, what was that? Red roaches! Yes, my uh, my least favorite enemy. I'm just kidding. They're, they're nice and simple to kill. Um, also seems to be the uh, the standard start uh, to go against red roaches, so that's fine. Let's get it on. Let's get it on with my little baton. I'm gonna beat the shit out of y'all. Hello. Oh, you are so done, son. One hit, one and done. Giant roaches. Yes, mate. Oh, cause he doesn't know what's happened. Oh, this is so cool. I'm just going to keep having a look around, because you've got to... Look, there we are, Bobby Pin's pre-recreational terminal. Oh, he puts the bat on away! That's so cool! Okay, so this is what they do for fun, I guess. What's this? Top 10, it said. Oh, these are the scores, okay. Play tape. Oh, the holotape. Red Menace, and we got an achievement, Future Retro. Um, start game. Oh, well, we all know what this is, don't we? <laughs> oh, God, this is brilliant. Is this Mario, isn't it? I've never actually played these games. Can we get down? Just say fuck it. Okay, so there's, like, bombs as well. Instead of, uh, just barrels. Doing. Wow. Wow. I'm doing so well. All right, watch out for that. Watch. Oh, oh. Nailed it. Let's climb up here. I do want to get that floating head. It looks like power armor. It is power armor. Oh, we can go through barrels now? But we can't... Yeah, you can't jump while you've got that, so that's not the most useful thing. Right, that barrel's gonna come down. We're gonna have to dodge that before we go up. Oh, no! One more try. One more life. Oh, we made it over that barrel. Next is this one. Yes! Right. Are we, are we home and gold? Golden homes. Oh no. Another barrel. Fuck. Lovely. Nailed it. Let's take him out. Oh wait, it just keeps going. Oh, you get points for destroying the... That's bullshit, that. Okay, that's really cool. Can you, uh, like, what were the scores? Oh, it doesn't say. That's really cool. I like that. I, I didn't see that my first time through this area. Let's go kill some roaches. 
Oh, okay. I was just about to ask, why are you not dead if you're that close to, like, lightning? There's one. Sneak up. Uh, it's seen us. It's also dead, so who gives a shit? Dead guy! Oh! Hello! Didn't actually see you there. Dead guy, and you have, like... Where is it? that one? What? Where's his skin? Oh, you are done. You are so done. Like I said, these roaches, they're not difficult. They're just irritating. Another dead guy. Oh, loads of Stimpaks. Loads of high quality Stimpaks. Is this all that's left? Yeah, probably. Um, and a gun. We got a gun. Right, in this game, you got a weird, um, if you can see there, you got a weird um, quick slots section. Overseer's terminal. Let's have a look at that bad boy. Bad boy. What have you got? Instructions. Confidential, confidential, confidential. Vault 111 is designated to test the long-term effects of suspended animation on unaware human subjects. You cock! They, was, they weren't going to save us from... I mean, they did save me from the explosion. But still, they were going to, like, perform experiments on us. Whatever. Let's open, let's open the evacuation tunnel. Awesome. Let's leave this, this shiznit. Wait, can't I just go out the regular way through the front door? What's in here? Ooh! The cr uh, cryonator. I'm imagining that's an ice gun. But I can't nice. unlock... Coming back later for you. I can't unlock... Uh, master. That's unfortunate. Now why can't I be like in Skyrim and Oblivion and you can try? Because then... We'd have one shot. Right, let's continue with the bats on on the uh, roaches. I don't want to. I don't want to oh, waste my ammo on these little things. Oh, it's a little one. Oh, no, that's not. Oh, right, that's his Q. Oh, I haven't used vats in this at all yet. I couldn't figure out how to do it. Oh, things move in in uh, in vats this time. Oh, you got stomped. You are stomped to shit. Right. Hello. You're done. <laughs> any more? Any more for any more? Oh, this is where we came. Oh, where we went in. This is the entrance. That's the door. Everyone's dead. Yeah, I think everyone is dead, mate. Whoa! Hello! You son of a bitch! I actually got jump scared by a red roach. Oh! Pit boy time! Look at it! I wonder what version this is, considering we saw Pitboy 1.0 in the opening sequence of the game. Oh, the quality, look at it. You see him actually clip it on. I always wondered how they got stuck on their arms. How is it dusty? Or, lots of things move, like there's lots of animations that weren't in there before. Oh, and he moves the fingers! I love it, look at it! Oh my god, I'm in love. Okay, cool, let's, uh, let's open the vault door. With a little cutscene. Oh, you have to. Okay, that's odd. You can't just open it like in the in the regular. Oh, the music's back. Please stand back. Not... Why is that raised? Oh, here it comes. I always loved how these doors open. They're so. It's so unique. Or at least I haven't seen anything like it. There it goes. Ah! Why is that over there now? What happened there? Oh, the bright light of freedom. Oh, I love the bright lights of freedom. Is there anything down here? No. Oh, the elevator! Was that automatic? Or did somebody send that down to me? We look really cool. Let's go up, shall we? Ah, this is where, this is the savey bit. I'm keeping everything. Let's go. Wow. Just, I know it's blurry at the moment, but oh my god, this, this is so beautiful. Holy cow. I have never played anything so beautiful. Like, I haven't had the ability, but now... Oh no, 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 I didn't actually mean to do that, but now, like, damn. Lone Wanderer, 
in the fallout of what used to be his home. Jump! No, no, let's not jump over. <laughs> okay. Right, let's have a look around here. Dead body. Dead, no, oh, several. Several dead bodies. I wonder if that, um, vault rep made it. I doubt it, but that would be quite funny if he did. Oh! Nuka Cola! And it's actually got, like, little, uh, rocket things on it. Um, little feet. What? What is this? Is that just rust? I don't know. I don't know. I also, I love the loot. I'm not going to push that. It doesn't do anything until you stand on that again. So we just leave that. It just makes an annoying noise. I like the looting situation. You don't have to open things. It just tells you what's in them. And then you can uh, scroll through what you want. That is an amazing improvement. It's going to speed things up so much. Like this. Look, you can just go, uh, I don't want the Molotovs. We'll take those. But I do. I do want the Molotovs. Everything's all, like, rusty. Does that happen when... Oh, I'm stuck. When nuclear radiation gets to you, do you do you rust up? Oh, crows. Crows. You'll fuck off. Let's get some target practice, shall we? Nailed it. Moving. Oh, no, he's gone. Well, we got one of them. That's more than I was expecting to get. I thought I'd just scare them off. Oh, what's up here? More dead bodies. Anything in the car? Anything in this car? No. Right, well we're kinda of going the wrong way, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go that way. Towards the uh, marker. Wait, what's what's sprint? Oh it's just shift now, instead of uh, all funky things. Wait, is sprint a new mechanic for Fallout? I think it is actually. I think you just had walk and run before, didn't you? Bottle cap, it's our first bit of currency. Even though our character doesn't know that that's currency yet, I'm assuming. I'm not quite sure how I'm going to record these episodes. Um, I think in future I'm going to... Because these uh, these two episodes are going to be rather short, these first two. But I think after that, when I have a bit more time, I'm going to record longer. And uh, then just cut in the good bits. Because obviously you don't want to see everything. But uh, you want to keep the interesting bits in. So I'll do that in future. Look at this beautiful game. Oh, shit. <laughs> Look at this beautiful game. He dies. Uh, it's just so crazy. This is ultra settings. I don't know if I did mention. Sanctuary. Where is Sanctuary? Sanctuary is where the heart is. Ah! Fuck off! Ah! Fucking... Ah, they scared the crap out of me, man. Where did the baby one go? It's just buggered off. Alright, we'll leave that one alone. Must be something good here if there's some enemies. I'll take the cigar. Oh, Nuka Cherry. Is that the new, uh, Yuka... Yuka? Nuka Cola Quantum. A, a locked suitcase. I like this. Right, I've not done this before either. So it's going to be the same, I mean it looks beautiful, but it's going to be the same mechanic as before. Lovely, first try, nailed it, happy with that. A tuxedo, yes mate! Oh, I'm so happy about that. I'm putting that on right away. Let me just, let me just go like that, just so we can see what it looks like straight away. Tuxedo. That's brilliant. I feel like, I feel like, um, I feel like the guy from Hitman. Like, I'm just wearing a disguise. That's wicked cool. First aid kits are always nice as well. I'm going to keep this out because obviously there are enemies around here. So let's just watch out. Right, we need to go that way. But I'm quite content just searching these houses for now. Right, we'll search one more, one more house. Oh, hello. Where, where are you? Oh, hello. Right, we'll search one more house as I was saying before rudely interrupted. Um, we will search one more house and then I'm going to end the episode here. God damn it, I've really got to look out for these bastards. Oh, television. Work, damn you. You suck. Oh, oh, found something. I was beginning to wonder if there was anything in this place. Hey, a fishing rod. That could be fun. Right. This house doesn't count. That's not the last one. There was nothing in here, so let's go somewhere else. Can I get, like... In here with parkour. 
Is there anything in here, do you reckon? I don't think there will be, but we can have a look. No, we can't actually drop down. Okay, never mind. What is this? That is nothing. Oh, go home. Where? Codsworth! Right! In which case, I'm going to leave the episode here. I don't want to ruin anything. Uh, don't want to start anything before the new episode. So, thank you very much for watching this one, guys. We've made it home. We made it out of the vault. And we, we've learned a few things about vats. And, and we found some stuff. And I look so freaking... I look so freaking badass. Hang on. Look at me. Just, just call me the penguin, man. Not the penguin man, just the penguin. Anyway, players, thank you very much for watching. If you did like this one, then please like, share, and subscribe. I'm loving this series so far, and I can't wait to play more. So, I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Do you really believe that God would send a flood? God has never punished anyone for anything. Uh, well... Really? Also, it's a laugh -hole.